Hey guys, Ken here from the Retro Thoracic Page channel in Malaysia. Thanks for joining me today. I'm pretty happy because something finally arrived in the mail after something like months. Okay, it's like my first ever shipment from Mattel Creations. Uh, this box right here is actually the uh, 40th anniversary He-Man and Skeletor set, the one that they actually announced a couple of months ago. Uh, apparently, it's taken until now for this thing to arrive here. Okay, now... Um, I've had a few attempts with Metal Creations before this, uh, well documented on my channel. Uh, the first one was the Koldar exclusive. Um, not really sure what happened with that one. There was some kind of communication error. Anyway, I didn't get it. Okay. And uh, of course, after that, we had the incident with Wanda, you know, the first time around. That's uh, well documented in a lot of videos on my channel as well. But this is the first one that actually made it down here, all the way down here to Malaysia. Okay. So we're going to crack this thing open. Uh, thanks for joining me today get out the blade here so you can rip it up we can check out how they actually package this thing to send it all the way down here and also uh guys if you don't mind if you haven't already subscribed to the channel i hope you guys can do me a solid and uh, just click on that subscribe button it really helps out the channel thank you and let's get down to getting this box opened up so okay let's get down to it you know i'm always somewhat hesitant when it comes to slicing open box flaps like these because I always feel like the package could somehow just be underneath the flap. It's happened before and the blade just went through it. Uh, but the box with this seems pretty big. All right, so there should be enough room, right? Okay, uh, let's just get these sides all open up. This isn't gonna be a full review of the set. I'm gonna do that separately in another video. But this one here, I'm just gonna share with you guys how this thing looks like out of the box so that uh yeah we can see how they actually pack this thing all the way down here and look at that there is a ton right, of protective materials look at this okay let's just get this all out of the way wow looks like they got this thing in here pretty secure get it all out is this uh a thank you note more like a bill of sale <laughs> check it out the full invoice okay and then we finally get down to our prized package yeah I'll be careful with this yeah look at that it's freaking amazing man look at that look at that artwork man you know I'm kind of surprised though that uh, they didn't actually bubble wrap this thing it's like uh, the underside of the box is just empty so this thing was pretty much just you know, bouncing around in there at the bottom um yeah let's get it out here on display guys seeing this this is freaking amazing but however uh one of the edges here is dented and this is obviously a result of the shipping because uh it seems like the protective measures they put in place here were sort of like uh halfway through all right because the exterior is all cardboard so this should have been bubble wrapped anyway just an amazing, amazing set to behold. Let's get this thing opened up. Okay, first up, on the back of the box here, we've got these amazing illustrations here as done by artist Axel Jimenez of both He-Man and Skeletor, both standing there with purpose. The specs are here too. It states here He-Man is 18.6 cm tall and Skeletor is 17.9 cm tall. So yeah, it's official. He-Man is taller than Skeletor. And that's what you want, right? I mean, everybody wants their heroes to be tall. Taller, in fact, okay? <laughs> Taller than us, okay, definitely. Okay, but this thing is just soaked with artwork. You know, top to bottom, front and back. If you rotate the box around to the sides here, you get these illustrations here. On this side here, you get He-Man's power sword, right? And on this other end here, you get Skeletor's Havoc staff really amazing stuff here and these are the flaps that open up the package so uh let's get the blade out again so we can slice this thing out ever so slowly all right you know, because the package is just right beside this okay you're starting to see it already let me just gently slide this whole section out you gotta get through layers before you get to the actual figures <laughs> look at that man it just says 40. Okay, but this is in fact on the back of the box. So what you need to do is rotate it around to the front. And wow, look at that, man. You're greeted by this massive 
shield symbol look at this wow wow and this thing at the top here kind of looks like the dead dealer's helmet from a frank frazetta painting that's not uncommon because there's a lot of frank frazetta influences in he-man what you gotta do is just um open this thing up like this yeah very carefully okay you don't want to dent the edges on this cardboard uh, was this something falling out from the package was this <laughs> uh it's like a plastic tray all right hope it's nothing important let's get this thing out here more stuff sliding out i guess these are meant to protect the interior of the flaps uh at least i hope so okay i don't know man this is the first time i'm seeing this together with you guys okay wow look at this man just look at what's waiting for you inside right both these guys just chilling in there all right look at this okay it's so freaking majestic but we're not done yet okay because there's layers to get through like i mentioned and first thing you gotta do is remove this exterior tray that's covering the figures yeah just get it out there wow it's really nice you don't want to ever damage that plastic bubble there okay wow <laughs> look at this man this is the first time i'm actually looking at this i've seen obviously tons of videos online okay talking about this but i've never actually seen it in person this is the first time on camera with you guys wow it is quite a sight seeing the whole presentation like this you know the way everything's just arranged the figures the weapons the uh, accessories like the ring i guess you know two comic books wow just freaking amazing guys you know wow i mean tell me guys you know have you guys gotten this set let me know in the comments all right now as i mentioned i'm going to be doing the video reviews for these figures separately and probably individually as well all right now i know that there's been hundreds of reviews already online this thing's been talked about to death but it's just that i never got it yet so i haven't provided my take on it so i'm going to be doing that i hope you guys look out for those videos i'm going to get working on them in the meantime i hope that all of you guys are doing great out there i want to thank you for your support of this channel for tuning into this video and all the videos that i'm putting out and I'll catch you guys again real soon with more content right here. Take care.